watching the Big 12 SEC Challenge presented by Continental Tire. Here inside Bud Walton Arena, two old Southwest Conference rivals getting set to meet for the first time in 10,570 days. It's been a while, Arkansas and TCU, two overachieving programs here in the natural state. Now something to watch for, can Arkansas in the half court pull Samuel away from the basket defensively? Too easy for nothing, TCU, and Eric Musselman has already seen enough less than two Good minutes this in. year, way ahead of the game, I think, than where a lot of people expected, but not for him. I mean, his expectation is to go to NCAA tournament. Harris buries a shot from downtown. Quarter triple. Desi Sills connects, and we're tied at six. That's the shot he was working on this morning, along with his assistant coaches. Well, he can shoot it. 46% as a freshman last year. Here's a steal. Little Euro step. And a putback by Harris. Trapping full court pressure. Here's another steal. Well, Brendan told you about the big win against Texas Tech. Carabello off the mark. Samuel gets it back up and in. Tied at eight. He's got all eight points for the Horn Frogs. And if you look back to the loss at Mississippi State, remember Reggie Perry, he had 26 points, 13 rebounds. And just his size, ability to attack the glass was a problem for Arkansas. Samuel having his way with them on the offensive glass so far. Adrio Bailey stepped back mid-range. All that. It's a good job of getting deep, and then he can fade with that high release on his mid-range game. Smith from downtown. That's why they got to get the up in. in transition. From downtown, Sills, his second triple. But it is offensive. right there. Start, but they've been slowed down here the last few minutes. Dennis off the mark. Samuel to put back in a chance for three. All Rogs, one of the top teams in the country. In turnovers, Witt. <laughs> Witt started his career at Arkansas, went to... Harris, a little Euro step. Somehow makes it to Sills. Three to shoot. Desi Sills with a bucket. A lot of people wondering, what's the big eight? What's the big eight? Bain off the back door, the reverse. And the putback by Grayer. Well, he didn't get the start. Witt. Boy, it felt like that one was going in. Really hadn't gotten an open look yet. Top score for TCU as the shot clock winds down. Fourth leading score in the Big 12. Here come the Hawks. Sills, Euro step. Somehow puts it up and in. Double figures for Desi. Over the last several minutes. And the lead. Four. Desmond Bain, fourth leading scorer in the Big 12, scoreless. Jimmy Witt is not. Give him six and a timeout for Jamie Dixon. Hawks lead it by seven. Five to go in our first half. Adriel Bailey rejected. Samuel got there. Oh, the reverse. Well, the rim was protection that first time. half of the board. You know what's coming. Silky, smooth. Crowd comes to its feet once again here at Bud Walton. Strong finish at the rack by Edgar six. Dennis. I think that's TCU right now in terms of the type of team that they are. We talked about it in the open. Big opportunity here for them today. Big bucket. Jair Square down for the Hawks with a five-point lead. Witt looking for Ethan Henderson inside. Gets it back, puts it in. Witt Jr. with well, They have to think about the long term with him. Witt lost the handle, turns it over. Fuller came out of there with it. Samuel wide open. Look out. Hawks got to hurry. Witt. Not known as a three-point shooter, and that's one of the reasons why. 0 for 2 now in the season in that department. But what a second half for Kevin. Desmond Bain still scoreless. Dennis from downtown off the mark. 
First meeting between these two since 1991. It's been a while. Jones, his first field goal, and it's a big miss from the floor. Bailey with the board. Here's Jones. Stolen by Went off the glass. Give him 14. Boy, great energy you get from Witt. A high motor, never lets up, and catches Samuel being careless. Bain answers his first points for of the Arkansas. Afternoon. That was the lead of the scouting report. But that's starting to change. Give him six. So I mentioned it. You know, what is Jamie Dixon going to do to get him involved? That's a special scoring play right there. Comes off a little staggered screen along the baseline. And with Bain's quick release, soft shot, he doesn't need much room. Bain so smooth. Jones answers. That's a long two. TCU not going away. Harris, Cheney. Boy, great execution on the ball screen. Harris, a great job of dragging Samuel to him, pulling him away from the basket. Bain left open, comes up short. Bailey the board. Bounce pass. Cheney! Jamie Dixon going to call a timeout. Another quick burst by the Hogs. 44-37. Skip pass to Mason Jones. Inside and Cheney spins it in. Hawks lead it by nine. Dennis makes it seven, and that was pretty. Air ball. Bailey. Up and in, and a chance for three. Well, Bailey thought he got all the ball. And stand around and watch Bain go make plays. Smith left open. Big Recent shot pass. from the wing. Give him three. He's got it going so far this year with 14 victories. Sills, the runner. Count it. Compelling. And the rest of college basketball should take note. There should be other challenges like this. There's alliances between leagues. And Jamie Dixon was just teed up. Joe Lindsay had it up. He teed up Jamie Dixon, and he can't believe it. Well, I was getting on the soap. I would consider it rather large, in fact, because Arkansas is such a disadvantage with size. Jimmy Buckets, another hoop. Give him 18. So what Jimmy Buckets does is he gets downhill and gets you retreating, and then he can pull up on a dime, and he's just got enough fade in that jumper to be able to score over the top. Back iron for Dennis. Boy, a fast break drill for the Hogs. Desi Sills from downtown. Desi with 16. The lead explodes to 11. A couple of others that could have been called as well. Jones. Mason Rim Jones with 11. Nimhart is short. Three on one. Sills off glass. 18 points, 7 of 8 from the floor. Desi Sills off the bench today has been on fire. Listen to this crowd. Big buck. Lead is 12, approaching 7 to play. Jones sizes up another one. Count it! Defensive effort. Contest a tough shot and then give up a long rebound. Harris. Wet, easy bucket. Wet's got 20, his six 20 point performance. This we'll season. end this one with an emphatic victory. Jimmy Witt Jr. with 22, Mason Jones with 20. And without Isaiah Joe, Arkansas finds a way. 78 67, the final score, Arkansas. Now 15 and 4. We'll send you to Tom.